So I've been getting a lot of messages regarding Roaring Kitty. Meow! Um, you know, whether he did the right thing or whether he did the wrong thing. I'm going to sum it up. I'm going to make it very simple. I don't know if Roaring Kitty sold any because he had 5 million GameStop shares. We know this. We know that he had short-term options expiring uh, June 21st of, of GameStop. Okay. So that's just options. But as far as shares are concerned, if he sold all of his shares on the run-up, that's not good. Because, you know, he was in his live stream talking very highly about Ryan Cohen and how he's going to turn the company around for the better. That sounds like a person who believes in the company for the long term. So if he sold, you know what I mean? That's a direct contradiction of what he said in his live stream. But I don't know if he sold it. I'm not going to sit here and speculate. Some people said he sold. Others say he didn't sold. sold. I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm not a mind reader. I don't have a crystal ball, okay? But it's really as simple as that. You know, you can't come out, pump up a stock, you know, and then sell immediately on a run-up because, hey, that does look like stock manipulation. I am not a lawyer who specializes in securities. Let me be very clear. I'm just a big man from Jersey who's about to get $300 worth of food. I'm going to make myself a big roast beef provolone hero, you understand? <laughs> so don't listen to me. I, I, this is not legal advice at all, but I'm just giving you my personal feelings that if you start pumping something up, even just, just getting people excited and, you know, you, you're going nuts and everyone's going crazy and there's a lot of sizzle and there's a lot of excitement and then you immediately sell, that might be interpreted as stock manipulation, but if you didn't sell, of course not. Then it's just a guy who's uh believes in the company for the long term. So it really just depends on what he did. I don't know what he did. And um all I could say is this. A lot of my retail brothers and sisters did well. Okay? And uh God bless you and God bless your families, everybody who made money. And I was a big fan of Roaring Kitty for that reason. And that reason alone is he was helping our retail family. But, you know, I don't know what he personally did. I'm not going to speculate, okay? So I'm just going to say everything I said on this video is alleged because I really don't have any solid evidence or solid proof, but I just gave you my views, okay? So this video is not financial advice. I am not a financial planner, but I am the greatest entertainer who has ever lived on planet Earth in the entire universe. The one, the only, a father in the house, baby. Wow!